In this episode, the Imperial Hall talks about Adderall. Enjoy the episode. And I'm just gonna make a statement regarding the Adderall. There is a lot of players that if they didn't have, like, use Adderall, they would be fucking dog shit. At the game. You were licking your lips like crazy. Yeah, some guy said that I'm doing cocaine because I'm licking my lips. Bro, you, what about, like, me just, my lips being dry as fuck? Oh, that was lucky. Why, why I'm helping you? What are you doing? Kashira walking up, guys. If Kashira was a, if Kashira was a controller player, he might have one clip hell and won the game. But getting getting that one clip on MK is so hard. It is so hard. Just watch. I think the show is POV. DF was doing absolutely terrible in finals. I don't know why, but they were the team that was up here, right? And they just straight up just into the roof. Just pushed the roof. And we just like went like, which is stupid. It's so stupid to do. Unless you get like a free kill. I think they just straight up 3v3 just jumped on their head without even like any knocks or anything. See another, another stupid push by, uh, I'm telling you, literally just some stupid teams doing stupid pushes. LG just... Inting the other team in God spot instead of just walking like playing their south side of the zone and just giving another team like we shouldn't be winning this spot. We should not be winning this game. But LG just like makes a stupid ass fight here in this situation and gets both teams killed and lets us win. That's that's the thing. Like, as soon as like people are like at lands and stuff, everyone's just so super nice. Like everyone's super nice, you know, because nobody wants to be known as like a dickhead or something. You've reached your limit on talking. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Okay, dude. <laughs> Alliance called for champs, not me. Not even close, baby. No! Nice. Yeah, probably wrapping around. No, I'm on clip. No, I should find you one. You got it. Nice. Let's kill this bitch. Padding up. Padding up. Get your ass out of here. <laughs> Bro, what are you doing? Oh my god! So, but yeah, this is the MVP one. I didn't put it in my check in bag, I was just like holding it. And, they, and I thought they were about to take it away. They would have probably made another one anyways for me. Fuck it. So, yeah. This is the MVP one. We got... So this is the MP, MVP one. We also had... Like, medals sent to us. Uh, did they really... The strat for them was to smoke where they were going to drop so we don't get aim assist. TSM is the most vulnerable, so expect an energy potential third party. They just played around that. Needs to back out. They're in a bad spot. Fnatic's gonna all in. They recognize it. Here comes the push. Oh my goodness, Matsutas, Meltstera, oh. Yuka are gonna fry TSM. Eliminated from the lobby.
Chat, I, I must say this right now. I didn't tell you guys. In third, in third game, in the last series on the second day, yo, the day where we had to play 12 games. In third game, I farted and a little juice came out. I'm not even joking. So like, I, I couldn't do anything about it, right? So it got like all crusty and shit. And when I got home from the hotel, my ass hurt so much. Like my entire ass was straight red from like scratching, like the ass cheeks scratching next to each other, right? And dude, I it hurt so much. I had to take a shower, dude, it was so bad. Were you, was I impressed with Evan's improvement? Yeah, it was funny. This is, I, I've never had a teammate do this before. You know what I mean? Like, I, I yeah, I've never had a team this, teammate do this before, but I didn't even know he was doing this. But after, I think it was after or during rally or some shit, he would write down things that he could approve on or the team could approve on on his phone. And he would reread it before he plays. And he was doing the same thing when we were playing in London. Like he would just have notes to like remind himself like certain things. And, and he was like, the, I, that, that is like the only person I have ever seen do that. I have played with like, you know, Jordan forever. He's never done that. Oh yeah, like the... Uh, he gets the extra space. I oh, get out. You just need the fist. He's playing with his... I needed to push right here. I needed to push like right, that was the only time, but it's like obviously hindsight. I thought he was gonna make the same mistake again and just like push me, like really close to the knockdown. But he, I think he realized I had I had no ammo. His food, Vicky. He's playing with his food. He's won. But he's one HP. No! Damn, that was way too close. Bro, like right here, I get like I get in like okay, this is like so weird to like describe it, but like I I get into this like you know how in movies sometimes they like I'm trying to how, how do I describe it. There's like scenes in movies where they like show another like another it's like a brain like a flow state or like a brain blast I don't even know how to like it's like a light bulb moment like literally like I it's like I saw the light like it got it's like I got it got it just got quiet and all of a sudden just I knew what to do I don't know it's like it's like weird that like straight like Jimmy Neutron moment. Tournament was really good. The game quality was actually really high for it for it being an eight meta. Group stages was a little sketchy, but the tournament quality was really good. Everything about the tournament was run really well besides my hands. This was like a lot of people complaining about the cold. Like it, it was really, really cold when we were playing. And uh, some of the admins were a little OD about a, a couple of the rules that aren't very important. Um, overall, it was still, like, you know, really enjoyable. I thought a ALGS did a great job. The fact they had COVID boost was really good as well. Did you guys know that Noob Hunter's viewers are not subbed? Subscribe now!